once you've purchased the Avalara for Shopify connector, you can add it to your Avalara account. Start by signing into your Shopify account. Make sure you have permission to install apps in Shopify. If you have more than one Shopify store, select the one you want to connect to Avalara. Go to your settings, select taxes and duties, and install the app. Confirm you're adding the new connector to your production environment, or tell us you want to add it to your sandbox environment. After you've added the Avalara for Shopify connector to your Avalara account, you can configure the connector settings. Start by signing into Avalara. Your user ID must have admin permissions in order to configure the connector. Select Show All Settings. Let's take a look at the connector's default configuration. Under Tax Calculation, we show you the Avalara company your online store is connected to you along with its company code. Save transactions in Avalara for reporting means that when some or all of the products in an order have been sent to the customer, we calculate the tax and save those transactions in Avatax. This way, transaction information will be included in your Avatax report information and you can reconcile your Shopify account with Avatax. If you change it to no, we'll calculate the tax and send it to Shopify, but you won't have a record of your Shopify transactions in Avatax. Some transactions may include a tax on the cost to ship the product. This may occur when a customer places an order with you, but another company fulfills the order. If the transaction is missing the tax code for the shipping cost, we'll use the generic FR shipping code. If you change it to something else, be sure it's a valid Avalara tax code. Under other settings, sync products with Avalara set to no means that your product catalog stays in Shopify. If you change it to yes, we'll add your Shopify items to Avalara, including the tax codes mapped to items if available. We'll do a daily check for new active items in Shopify to add to Avalara. With your new connector, you can map your items in Avalara, Shopify, or another business app. To learn how to map in Avalara, take our Map What You Sell to Avalara Tax Codes lesson in Avalara University. Select Confirm to save your changes. If you selected No to sync products with Avalara, or if you selected Yes but don't have a large Shopify product catalog, select Go to Shopify and select Activate Avalara Tax Compliance. If you selected Yes to sync products with Avalara and you have a large Shopify product catalog, select Wait. This gives the connector time to import your items into your Avalara product catalog. To check your product catalog for your Shopify items, go to Settings, What You Sell and Buy, and check for your items. When you're ready to activate your connector, go to Shopify. Go to your Settings, Taxes and Duties, and activate Avalara Tax Compliance. Once your connector is activated, you'll need to create test transactions to ensure everything is working as expected.